Hey, good Monday morning. It's good to see you. Good to be back for at least a week here. Um, so our gospel day is from Mark chapter 3, verses 22 through 30. And this is the, the one scene where uh, the scribes uh, who had come from Jerusalem said to Jesus, Hey, if you're casting out demons, it must be because you are from Satan yourself. And Jesus says, Well, that makes absolutely no sense. Uh, and he calls them on it. He basically t- uh, talks to them about logic, saying, you know, if I were coming from Satan, why would I uh, destroy my own work then? Because uh, demons are being expelled. This is a house divided against itself cannot stand. You know, and so he's making a point. Obviously, he can't be from Satan. And he goes on to say there's this one phrase that people kind of uh, talk about. That he says, whoever uh, sins and blasphemes, people will will be forgiven him. But whoever blasphemes against the Holy Spirit, that sin will never be forgiven. You think about what the Holy Spirit does, binds together the Father and the Son. So he's basically calling him, because they said he's from Satan, not from God. So he's calling him on that. But for me in this, what I hear is about divisions. Um, and Jesus talking about divisions. And obviously, um, He's calling them on because they're, they're, they're fighting him. He's doing good works and they don't see it, and they're divided because it looks like he's not doing the good works according to the way they want it. And I think we all can kind of get into that. Um, It's about the ego. You know, we cause divisions not because of right and wrong, but because of our egos. We think it has to be our way. And if it's not our way, then we think it's wrong, and then we start hurling accusations. So we see all kinds of divisions uh, like this. Of course, classic example is our own Congress, but also it is that happens in the church. There are divisions now. There are people, you know, who say the Pope is this, the Pope is that, or right, left, blah, blah. And it happens in our parishes. Uh, people, uh, e- people's egos get wrapped around what they're doing, and they think that's the way it has to be done. Anybody who is different must be bad. So I think we need to always look at ourselves and look at our own divisions. And I would be willing to bet, as Jesus would say, it's not about the right or wrong. It comes from our egos uh, that we are causing divisions because we are basing everything on our ego. So maybe we need a little bit more humility, a little bit of openness, which the Holy Spirit brings to us to open us up, to open our eyes up so we can see the ways of others and to see beyond our our narrow frame of reference, our own egos. Okay, hopefully that is more than just a a Monday morning ramble after one cup of coffee. But uh, I'll see you all tomorrow. Uh, Hey, uh, Nevadans, Serenoites, let's hope that the storm that comes in tomorrow, uh, I know they're only staying a few inches up in the mountains, but... Maybe uh, it'll get stuck here and we'll just drop, drop, drop snow. Okay, take care. Bye-bye.